Awesome. Uh, my name's Nick. It's so very cool to be here. Um, I didn't always want to be a stand-up comedian. Uh, when I was a kid, I really, really wanted to be a magician. Um, I got bullied about it. I didn't make it easy on myself. I mean, I already have red hair. I didn't need to also be a magician. <laughs> but I got bullied about my magic, and I stopped doing it. And in hindsight, um, thank God, because otherwise <laughs> I would be an adult magician. Uh, <laughs> Look, don't get me wrong, magic is awesome. I just don't understand why such a big part of being a magician seems to involve being a creep. <laughs> like, how does that help the magic? Like, you know, David Blaine, Chris Angel, Dynamo, they're all so creepy. It used to be like, magic! And now it's always like, magic. <laughs> magic. Magic. <laughs> Is there some magic school where they're like, here's how you pull a rabbit out of a hat, and here's how to dress like the sort of guy who would pretend he's allergic to condoms. <laughs> I also took capoeira at school, which, if you don't know, is a form of Brazilian dance fighting, <laughs> which was developed by uh, slaves in the 17th century to disguise the fact that they were about to attack the Portuguese. Uh, very noble discipline. There's really not that many real-world applications for a 12-year-old white kid. Like, there was never a point when I was getting bullied about my magic that capoeira came in handy. Some guy's like, Nick, your magic sucks, bro. Oh, yeah? Well, I thought he was going to attack us. But no, he's just doing some sort of cool dance. All right, let's all let our guards down. Thank you so much, guys. We'll be next time. Have a great night.